This is an epic Grills Gone Wild. We're gonna roll what they call a fatty. All I'm doing here is making sure all the, the meat is together because when we go to patty it out, I don't want it to fall apart. That's what we call beating your meat. This thing I'm gonna do is take a little bit of that, right Part over the paper. top. What we're gonna do here is we got, I think there's roughly six, six and a half, seven pounds of hamburger, uh, pork burger, sausage, all mixed into this. Now if you combine it with your Greek seasoning and your Lowry's, mix it up real good, put it in a bowl and we're going to slowly work on pattying this thing out. Try and get to about a half inch thickness. Yeah, maybe a little less if you can do it. It's kind of hard. Half to a quarter inch. And about I like to take a look at it. Beautiful. Push a little bit more. A little bit more. Once this all comes together, we're gonna stuff it with anything you want. We're gonna use chicken, pepperoni, bacon, pepper jack cheese, Swiss cheese, and mushrooms. This is one of those things that you can use your full imagination on. You can add stuff, you can leave stuff out, whatever your heart desires. Now that we got our patty out, we're gonna sit here and play with it for a little bit. We're gonna cook some of this. We gotta, I like this pre-cooked bacon. What we're gonna do is cook a little bit of that, stick a little hat inside too. First up, a little bit of pepper jack. Cheese. Pepper Jack Cheese. Gonna be a lot of flavors in this bitch. Lots of flavor. Lots of flavor. Back on. That's French for bacon. Bacon? It's a little early in the morning right now. We haven't quite started drinking yet, but it will commence here in a little yeah, bit. Yeah, we're gonna pop a couple tops. We're gonna pop a couple tops. Where's the Canadian bacon on these? Oh, we forgot the Canadian, Canadian bacon. bacon. Got no! Bacon. We got bacon, we just needed the Canadian brother. Need its Canadian brother. Mm. Of course, I don't. I don't have a knife out here either. Great. All right. This Canadian bacon is made from pork sirloin. Don't get much better than pork sirloin. Not bad at all. And the idea is to try to keep all of this kind of fairly centered. It's like a burrito of awesome. Because it's kind of a really pain in the a-hole to roll it up. That's where the finesse comes into play. That's where the finesse is going to come in. This is only the second one we've ever made. First one turned out awesome. We're going to see how this one turns out today. Should be better than the last one. We're gonna hope. And don't get too carried away on loading up the inside of this thing because when you roll it up, you're gonna want a thin layer of everything. Because when you're putting in six, eight different things, you need a thin layer of each. Otherwise, it's just got not, not gonna go together. Last time I put sausage in it, um, piled it in pretty heavy. It was a real pain, but it turned out good. Yeah, it did. 
I don't know about you people out there, but I like me some mushrooms. I see you drink some water out of these. Drink one can on a deal. Yeah. Definitely Next thing, the old lady, she likes a little bit of pepperoni in here, so I'm not a fan of it, but I'm going to put it in anyway. Fun fact, pepperoni is the number one ordered pizza topping from pizza chains in America. I don't know why. I don't not, know why either. It's not that good. Tastes like rotten sour meat. But she likes it, so we'll put it in there. That's <laughs> all that matters, right? That's right. Happy wife is a happy life. Chick in here. I know what you're saying. All this into one thing. Are you crazy? Yeah, I am. Yeah, we are crazy. So kind of mad you asked, actually. You just stick it in there. It's all good in the hood. It's all good in the hood. I also like to put a little bit of that inside. That's its own layer right there. <clears throat> Flavor of awesome. Pull that inside. Now what I'm gonna do here is I got some Swiss. Everybody likes Swiss cheese melted. I know they do. If you don't, you're a liar. I also know what you're saying. More cheese? Yes, more cheese. You gotta have the. Everybody likes the melty goodness of Velveeta. Yeah. So I always like to put a little Velveeta in there too. Last time I checked, this is America. It's America. We do what we want. When we want, how we then want. Then what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna pile on a little more insides. I think I got the room yet. It's definitely coming together though. I like it. I like the way it looks. Some more of that. It's more of the stuff I like on there. The burgers like a little bite too. Yep. For the man. Let's see if you can catch it. Oh. oh. He can though. No. Nope. Well, didn't even pay attention. <laughs> Dance. Here. There you go. There you go. Here, Bert. And chance to catch one more time. Woo! All right. Here we go. Oh, there it is. I think we're we're probably pretty good on the inserts. Assembly is complete. Assembly is complete. Now the I hard part. I wish you guys would be able to watch what we're gonna do here, but I think I'm gonna need the extra hand. Um, I'm gonna try it here so you guys can watch a little bit of it. Just by myself. But we might have to shut down the camera. I'm not sure yet. together here a little bit on the ends. God, that looks beautiful. Obviously there's gonna be a little more hamburger on top so it's folded together. That's okay. Next comes the Funnest part. Wrapping it in bacon. Yep. After we get it in the pan. But the thing you want to do is you want to get it all kneaded together. If you don't, she wants to fall apart. Looking pretty tight. Looking pretty tight. Now the hard part, you gotta get this into that. Good. 
We, we made it in the pan. It's in the pan. Just some fine tuning. There you go. You're in the center of the pan. Get in there. <clears throat> Holy crap, we made it. All right. Get rid of this for a minute. More bacon. Thick cut. Non cooked bacon. Yeah, kind of start, tuck. Get, tuck. A little bigger than the last one I did. Yeah, a couple pounds bigger. We got a lot of people that want to try it, so hopefully it turns out good. I'm going to go ahead and make all this bacon fit. Can't let bacon go to waste. If anything, there's never enough bacon. Last but not least, seasoning of the gods. A little bit more cavenders. And a little bit more Lowry's, which is also right up there. As of right now, we're done for a quick second. That was easy, wasn't it? Pretty easy. Easy, 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 lemon squeezy, lemon squeezies. Next step, just gonna hit the badass trigger grill. What I'm gonna do, I'm gonna smoke this on just smoke for an hour before I kick up the temperature. Okay. I'm gonna let her take on some smoke. I'm gonna go ahead and crack one of these. I take a big old swallow out of her. Yeah, make sure it's good beer. Put a skunky beer in there, you're just wasting your time. Put that inside too. It's just gonna help moisture, basically. Mm -hmm. Good stuff. We'll check back on this in an hour before we crank our temperature up. As you can see, she's smoking, she's ready to go. It's gonna roll. So, shit's about to get real. <laughs> Let me show you something. Look at that. Look how awesome that looks. Part near ready to pull off here. Sitting in its own juices and bacon grease and awesome and all that good stuff. Alright. Final stages of rolling a fatty. It's been on the smoker for five and a half, six hours. Yeah, six. Ready to eat. We're gonna carve into it. We're gonna try to pull it off here. Set it on here and let it rest for a couple minutes. Important to let it rest. And uh, we're gonna eat this bitch. Probably not all of it. It's like kind of me. Yeah, it's a lot.
That's meatloaf on steroids. Good shit. A few mushrooms fell out of it. Oh yeah. Not wrong with that. Not wrong with that. It's hotter than hell though. Be careful. Yep. Yep. Nope. 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 Some beer. Some beer. Some beer. Some beer. Probably a good amount of beer in there. If anybody wants it. Mm. Put that back in the fridge. We'll let this rest and then we'll fucking We're gonna carve, it. carve it out and take a look at the insides of this monster. Monstrosity. All right. All apart. That's all it's doing. Look at that. And that is a bona fide fatty. That's called rolling a fatty. Is that a fatty? That is a fatty. Put your own shit in it. Try it out. <clears throat> and uh, Whatever you want. Don't let it intimidate you. It's good stuff. It's time to eat. And enjoy.